Now, every protocol that we bring out after this, for instance, iBurn, um, it's not the total amount of pulse that goes in burns uh, the iBurn or yeah, the iBurn off the market. 15% of each protocol that's being developed after this now is going to buy and burn PGIF. So PGIF is going to benefit from each one of these protocols that come out. And we've got them lined up. We've got three new new protocols coming out here in, in the near future. Um, and they're just lining up. People want us to put the buy and burn feature on, on their tokens. And uh, and then there's yeah. all kinds of things that we can do with the, with the liquidity pools and other things. And then we're also going to be building a bridge within the, the contract that is going to, and we're going to do it on Titanx. So we're going to bring the value of Titanx over to Pulse Chain by creating Pulsar. So it's going to be the same same function, but now we're going to use a bridging versus just building it native on Pulse. We're going to use a bridging uh, uh, protocol within the contract to bring value over to Pulse Chain. Cool. And if that sounds really cool, so I have them. not reset. Uh, sorry, money guy, go ahead. Let me. I was going. I was. Gonna, yeah, I was just going to add to that. Like, if people, if protocols want to get involved and actually implement this and use this and stuff like that what's the pitch to them or what's the pitch? To, how do they get involved? Essentially. That's probably so, <laughs> so, so we, um, we, we want to make sure that we're burning the right tokens. Um, some tokens aren't meant to be burned. Some tokens don't need to be burned. Uh, some, this will enhance and, and, and do good for that tokens ecosystem. So mm -hmm. we're going to vet that process. We're going to speak with the communities, uh, with these these other coins. We're not just going to grab a coin and say, "Hey, we're going to put the burn protocol on it." We're going to we really want to get the input from the communities, the founders, and see if that's even a right fit for them uh, versus just grabbing everything and burning it. You know, gotcha. um, it's going to be a, a you know comprehensive look at at every every uh, protocol that we bring on board. So yeah, we we've, we've got people lining up and asking us. So we're we're looking at the uh, the 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 reason that we really we we really set up a a better way to do this because um, when we did the Icosa Hedron um, Iburn uh, protocol, we mentioned it. We didn't ever get any feedback from the community, and when it launched, it kind of like uh, it it. it it, 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 I think it was a sour launch as far as what people, how the community didn't feel like they were involved. The ICOSA community didn't feel like they were involved and we don't want that to happen again. We want to make sure that every community that's that, that and every founder that's involved here uh, understands what's going on and wants to be part of it. And so we've, we've, we've set up a different measure of, of uh, protocols ourselves and things that we're going to do to make sure that that happens. Right. 